But here's um, our first cruise, and it's a half price offer. So this is actually half the original price at 529. And it's the peak date. When you look at the most expensive time to holiday, yeah. August. That's right. The, the lead date is the 8th of August, but also that's traditionally a time when you know that a lot of families and, and noisy children are on holiday. Gemma can say this because Gemma is a mum. Yeah, well. I am a mum. Yeah, so when I say noisy children, I'm talking about my own. But with this ship, it's an adult-only ship. Wow. So nice opportunity to go yeah. away, nice, inexpensive So if you were going away in August, there might be a lot of children around, not a single one on this uh, <laughs> on ship. This. And it's a brand new ship uh, to the fleet, I should say. That's uh, they've right. just acquired the ship, called the Magellan, of course. But let's talk about Cruise and Maritime, because they're a really friendly company, Absolutely. really down to earth. Yeah, British uh, cruise line, and you get your fantastic value for money with this you cruise. You do, don't you? And as you say, this particular ship is a new addition to their traditional five-strong fleet. Uh, it's called the Magellan, and it's named after the famous Portuguese explorer. And this is going to be its maiden season in 2015. So it's a really lovely, comfortable interior. It is adult only, which means for those of you who just want to totally unwind in a very relaxed atmosphere or just socialize, you know, with a load of other people that you might want to meet on board, this is the ship for you. Um, the home port is Tilbury, but you've Lovely. also got so departure points where, if you ever want to cruise with them from other places. But it's great food on board as well. You've got the Waldorf and the Kensington restaurants. Lovely spa, as you can see. Great service friendly staff um, you're gonna have a great time basically and this is all about value for you to get away for eight nights yeah. on the 8th of August for 529 pounds per person is amazing but it yeah. is a half price offer and only a deposit needed tonight by the way to skew your place on board just 150 pounds per person um, and when we talk about the ports, they're going to be beautiful, aren't they? Oh, oh. yes. Yeah. So we are off to the Scottish Isles and, and the Faroes. And, you know, at this time of year, if you get some nice sunshine, it's going to be really gorgeous sailing around this part of the world. Stunning scenery. Yeah. And uh, as we mentioned, this is the latest addition to her fleet. So this will be the maiden season on board the Magellan. Um, right. Let's show you where you're going to be cruising too. So we're starting off the port of Tilbury. That's so, right. No flights, everything's easy. The great thing is when you are cruising from the UK, you can take as much luggage as you like. It's a real well. benefit actually because yeah, you don't have to worry about the, the weight of your luggage or no. the size of the bottles of the toiletries that you're taking and then you arrive and your bag will be taken off and the next time you see it, you'll be in your cabin and off you go. So we've got a day at sea and then we're arriving in Lerick, which is in the Shetland Islands. Um, it's actually Shetland's only town with a population of about 7,500 Oh, I know. It's really gorgeous. Really beautiful. I mean, look at this scenery that you can see here. And then on the waterfront, you've got these amazing sandstone buildings. Um, and you can just wander around on foot or go up to the hillside and overlook the harbour. Um, you've got some beautiful ruins you can go and visit. Famous, of course, for the Shetland ponies. Maybe you will spot one. And then we're going to Torshavn in the Faroe Islands. Um, and you arrive there on day four. The Vikings were amongst the first people to set foot here. You imagine as they saw this remote, rugged scenery. And in fact, it's the same scenery that the cruise ship passengers are seeing now. Look at these lovely puffins. So Torshavn is the capital of the Faroe Islands. Um, and you can reach most part of the islands in about 90 minutes or less. You've got loads of outdoor activities in various forms. So if you want to go hiking or bird watching or fishing. But you can also just walk into the town from where the cruise ship docks, which is quite nice, and have a little wander. Yeah, I'm just thinking it's ridiculous. You know, I, I've never ever been here, and yet it's actually, I know, you know, I know, so yeah. close to home. It's Absolutely, ridiculous. And, you don't and, have to go that far. And everyone says so beautiful. Where next, then, Gemma? Well, then we're off to Kirkwall in the Orkney Islands. Uh, Kirkwall is the capital of Orkney. So it's a little town on the northern shore. And again, I've never been here, but it looks so beautiful, doesn't it? And in August, again, it's the perfect oh, it time is, of year it? to visit visit these places it really is um, and then what's really nice about this itinerary is that you sail into Leith which basically means Edinburgh I'm not sure how that no. accent was um, but Sharon who's Scottish <laughs> you'll be upstairs going oh my word but Edinburgh I love I've been so many times and it is such a beautiful city and of course at this time of year it is 
buzzing with culture, with the all the um, the, the festival, of course, well, the French I, festival, yeah, the comics. Say, I, I've been to Edinburgh several times, the most beautiful city, but I've always wanted to go to the Edinburgh festival. Oh. But to get accommodation is a nightmare. Yes. And we're actually there overnight on board as the festival is taking place. Yeah, aren't absolutely we? amazing. So you can catch some shows, you might go and see some. I remember seeing Johnny Vegas years ago at Edinburgh Festival before, before he was, was famous. famous. Yeah. And I mean, he was so funny. He actually got my friend on stage and married her. But that's another story. So we, so we, could, <laughs> so we could see a show, of course. Because of yeah, and board. exactly. And of course, you'll want to go to Prince's Street, and you've got so much to do. The Royal Mile, the Edinburgh Castle has got to be seen as well. And then day eight, you're back at sea, and day nine, sail back to Tilbury. So it's a really nice cruise. Um, and as we mentioned, it is a half price offer tonight for this one date, the 8th of August, from just £529 per person. The ships in general, with um, Cruise and Maritime tend to be smaller, more intimate ships, yeah. don't they? Yeah. And again, talking here of the deposit, you know, £150. So if you've got your money put aside for Christmas, well, at least, you know, you can do that, secure your holiday and get through the uh, rather grim weather that we've got at the moment. Now you've got a nice little break coming up in August. Uh, and, and don't forget, this is the latest addition to the fleet as well. So that is the, the maiden season. 529 is the price tonight, and it is an adults only ship. So, you know, I know there's always that little bit of a, a danger when you are going away in August, and if you don't want to be, I shouldn't say daft or terrible, so that's, you know, oh, it's we, we fine. love our kids. But yeah, of course. And, you know, but, but if you haven't got children, then sometimes being in an adult only environment, let's face it, that's something that yeah. you would want, want to have. Other people's children <laughs> can be quite annoying. <laughs> well, 529, half by soft, as you mentioned, the maiden season of the brand new mm -hmm. ship. Who's that among one of the, you're going to be one of the first to sail on her, of course, mm -hmm. as well. We've got a single special on this one actually from eight to nine as well. So great single prize, and you're going to be eight nights on board. Now, very important, you you know maybe you've never called Planet Cruise before. It is a free phone number. Our phone lines are open until ten thirty tonight and eight o'clock tomorrow morning. So even if you you're just tempted or you've just got some questions, yeah, or actually. And I hope we find your cruise tonight, but don't forget, if you don't see something like tonight, but you fancy the idea of a cruise, we can find you any cruise with any cruise liner, any length, anywhere in the world. And uh, we're going to be seeing and meeting Chris from the call centre a little bit later on. 529, though, is the price on that first half-price cruise.